All right, arrived at CES 2024, and this is the Venetian section where the 3D printing is going to be, but I'm here not just for 3D printing, but uh, uh, I have uh, AR glasses because I already have these Ray-Bans, and anything that's cryptocurrency, blockchain, I'm also interested, but yeah, we'll see. Extreme quality, the roof is really terrible, so I'm redoing it, and going through all the parts. These are some of the parts that you can make with the Makara aluminium. Every part here was made with the Makara except for the springs and this. And look at this in brass. It was smooth and polished but quality is amazing. And lots of people who went to drones could make their own copper fiber parts. This is wood. And the quality of this is 0 0.001 millimeters, apparently, which is amazing. And that's that. That's Makara. And here's Coast Runner, and this whole section is just 3D printing and CNC. Their stuff can cut steel, so it's a smaller build, but it cuts steel. I don't know much. And here we have Form Labs. This is their automated system where it automates pulling off prints and dropping them in here. Here's a little farm example from Form Labs. And here is the Form 1 MJF over here. And here is the curing station they have, which looks awesome. They have a separate station curing and washing. And this is their large form of resin printer. And here they're showcasing all the various products that they can make. And they keep showing that this can be hammered. Back here at Coprint where they clipperize printers and make it multi-material. Maybe we'll take a look at the actual, oops sorry, the, the makes. And this is the GoFu 3D printers which they actually have a whole host of 3D printers. They have huge 3D printers, 606 by 100, and apparently they can print peak. So go check them out if you're interested. I've never heard of them before. And they have cute printers here. And here's the Kokani. Seems to be running pretty fast. Here's their version of the AMS, but I don't think it's operational. And I don't know how their Kickstarter is going, but let me know in the comments. There are these cute 3D printers over here. Which the quality, look, quality looks pretty good. And at Creality, this was a surprise for me. Sermon D3. Looks like the purge block has come off, but it's still printing. And the quality, I mean, I don't know about that, but the quality here looks really good. I don't know if you can see that. A little slow for a large format printer. Here's the K1 Max, which is not currently printing. But I think the build quality looks amazing, especially compared to my bamboos. I still love the bamboos. This is their Ender V3, which interestingly enough has belted Zs. Ah, it looks amazing. Looks like a very high Z as well. Oh, 250 only. Mm. And this is the regular K1. Looking good. And here is the laser engraver once again in a really nice enclosure. A lot of the 3D printing companies are getting into these. Other than that, there's just uh, here Next Tech, Next Legendary Power uh, resin printing manufacturer. Oh, I can smell the fumes. Oh, that looks really good. The quality of these look amazing. That's it for the 3D printing section at. CES.